Here are some quick tips on how to approximate the size of generator you'd need based on how you expect to use the generator most of the time. First, determine your largest power need. For example, if your home water comes from a well, a 5,000 watt generator is required. If your RV has a single rooftop AC system, a 3,000 watt generator is necessary. If your job site has only one tool to be powered, only a small 2,000 watt generator is needed. Once you've determined which device has the largest wattage requirement, be sure you understand the actual starting wattage required. This is especially true of devices with motors like pumps, refrigerators, or power tools. The device that requires the most power on startup will determine the minimum wattage size you'll need. If you're looking for a generator for home backup power, there may be minimum sizing requirements you need to consider. First, if your water supply is from a well, chances are you'll need at least a 5,000 watt generator. If your hot water tank is electric, consider a 6,500 watt or larger unit. And if you have an electric heating source, count on needing at least 15,000 watts. If you don't have one of these three devices, you may well be able to use a smaller generator, such as a 3,000 watt to supply your basic emergency needs. For those interested in portable power to be used for primarily recreational purposes, here are some simple questions that will help get close to determining the right sized unit for your needs. If you plan on using your generator for dry camping and just want to run some lights, a fan, and charge an auto battery, then a 1,000 watt model may be sufficient. If you'd like to run a microwave, hair dryer, and coffee maker, consider a 2,000 watt model. For RV campers, consider either a single 3,000 watt unit or a connected pair of 2,000 watt units to run a single rooftop AC unit. A 6,500 watt generator would be required for dual rooftop AC units. In work or construction type situations where all you expect to power is a single tool, like a drill, radio, and be able to charge tool batteries, a 2,000 watt generator should be sufficient. If two power tools will be used at the same time, consider a 3,000 watt unit. Powering multiple tools simultaneously will probably require a 5,000 watt or larger unit. If 240 volt power is required, expect to select a 5,000 to 10,000 watt model. Many job sites are required to comply with certain rules like OSHA guidelines. Honda EB Series generators meet all OSHA job site requirements for portable power.